Hey, Felix. Hey, Connor. Got everything you need? Yep, it's in my backpack. We're walking. We see a lady, sitting alone, staring at a roll of toilet paper. I open up my backpack, and I give her a blanket. We pass by a house, and see a woman, deep in thought, drinking a cup of something warm. Let's not disturb her. I leave a blanket for her on her doorstep. We pass an apartment and see two adult twins eating cheesecake and arguing and watching Seinfeld. Do you know what Seinfeld is? Nope. That's okay. We pass a woman on a pedestal, yelling to the crowd, but no one listens to her. We pass a king with a crown in an alleyway staring at his iPhone. Finally, we make it to the water. Hey, Felix, what are you going to miss? My family. A family of whales pokes their noses out of the water. A girl is riding one. I open up my backpack and give her a blanket. And then, it starts to happen. Up in the sky, Jupiter and Saturn are this close together. In front of us, the air is swirling and humming, and a bridge appears. At the middle of it, we feel a kind of wall. I have to step through before time runs out. Please, Felix. You are the only one who can tell us what's on the other side. I step through. I hear wailing. Like crying. I hear a gust of wind. I smell five guys burgers and fries. I feel clouds under my feet. I feel the footsteps of my enemy. They are tiny. They are far away. They are right behind me. I turn around to walk. All I see is the portal. On the other side is you. But you look different. Your skin is whiter. Your hair is blonde. Above you, I see a ghost, but not any ordinary ghost, a phantom that is haunting you. Your mind is possessed by the phantom, and you look deep in thought. You try to step through the portal, but you can't. The bridge falls apart, you fall into the water dimension. I open up my backpack. I pull out Dr. Rainbows. He is a rainbow llama stuffy that I won from the claw machine outside the Cineplex. In the air dimension, Dr. Rainbows grows to be the size of a real llama. I ride on his back. I am Dr. Rainbow. I am an alien llama from a planet that was getting attacked by a bunch of evil guys. They captured me, and every day I have three powers to help me in whatever situation I'm in. And that's how I escaped. Do you smell that, Dr. Ramos? Five Guys Burgers and Fries? Let's go. 
Dr. Ammos and I eat Five Guys burgers and fries on a table made out of clouds. They don't charge us. Then we carry on. We approach a giant statue. It is metal, titanium gray, in the shape of the gas that is possessing you. It's making the wailing sound. It is still. Dr. Ambos approaches it suspiciously. He hisses and jumps away. <laughs> That's when I smell copper. Th this isn't right. It's titanium, not copper. I knock on the label. It's hollow. I unscrew the label and go inside. It's a whole layer filled the, with copper, big enough for the biggest electric storm through the ages. I see a trap door made out of clouds. I look down, and I see Earth. I realize I'm in the clouds, where no one, no kid, no parent has ever gone.